Hey Stampers, welcome to another week of Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey, part of the Stampin' Jill creative team. And today I'm excited to share with you a stamp set and bundle that is in the annual catalog. It's this one here. It's on page 116 of the annual catalog. It's called Art in Bloom. Such a pretty stamp set. And it coordinates and bundles with this die set, but also an embossing folder. It's called a hybrid embossing folder and they all coordinate together. And I want to show you how to use them with the stamp set and the die set and the embossing folder all together. Just give you a few tips on that. So let me pull in here the stamp set. This is it, the Art in Bloom. It has these super cute floral flowers and leaves and cute things. This um, stamp here is actually um, one stamp. It has three flowers all attached on it. You can see here. And that um, makes it really easy to use the embossing folder, this embossing folder, as well as the die set that comes with it. So I want to show you how to use this all together. So I'm going to start by stamping um, on basic white. I'm stamping memento black and just give a really crisp um, image here with my flowers. Just like that. Okay. And then I'm going to take petal pink and I'm going to use this. Um, it's kind of like a coloring in image um, for the flowers. So there's one for each of the flowers. This one is for this one down here. And I'm just going to do that one just to kind of show you what I, how to use it. Okay. So just like that. And then I'm ready to pull in the embossing folder and the die. And you can see the die just fits perfectly on those three flowers and the, and the embossing folder too. So it just fits right around that image. Just like that. Okay. Just kind of sets right in there. And then you're going to take your stamped image and you're just going to line that up in the embossing folder and the die. So just move that around. Let's see. And then just move the image until it fits right in there. Okay. And then I'm going to grab my die cutting machine. This is the stamp and cut and emboss machine. And I am just going to run that through. Okay, and then we're going to grab that out. And you can see it's just like that. Okay, and you can see this embossed as well onto the white, but I'm not going to use this piece. I'll show you um, on another card what it looks like with the embossing folder. But you can see on this um, flower, it not only cut it out, but it also embossed that image there. So cute. Here's the one we're going to use for our card. So cute. So I'm not going to finish this entire card, but I'll show you the finished product here. Here, never not loving you. So cute. So there's our flower. I added some leaves and some accessories. So, so fun. Love it. Um, here's a few other ideas I've made creating or using this um, bundle of products. So we have this one I didn't stamp first. I just ran it through and cut it out. So it's kind of more of a monochrome look there. And then here, this is the one I used the embossing folder on the back. You can see, so cute. And then I just used the die to cut these flowers out and didn't um, run them through the embossing folder. So you can see the kind of the difference that that makes, but still super cute and very fun. Love it. Okay, so Stampin' Up! has come out with one other stamp set bundle that has this hybrid embossing folder in it. So I wanted to show you that one as well. It's in the mini catalog that's for the holiday season. Um, it is this cute one here, Merriest Moments. So fun. 
This is what the embossing folder looks like. Hopefully you can see that there. It has this cute frame and then it has all this greenery and stuff around it. It's super duper cute. And then the, the dies that coordinate. Okay, so on this one, it's this fun frame that can cut out along with the embossing folder. And it has this other little frame in here too. So, um, and this one's stitched, so cute. So let me show you, um, I haven't had a ton of time to play with this one, but I wanna show you just the one card that I've come up with using this set. So fun, you can see here that that got cut out and then it has the embossing on it too. So cute, so fun. I have loved playing with this idea, um, this new hybrid embossing folder. Super fun, really easy to use, and it's just really cute. So if you have any questions, make sure to let us know. If you want to share any of your ideas with us, make sure to tag us at Stampin' Jill. And make sure to visit our website at stampinjill.com. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next week for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.